said it's conscious sedation, which means I have to actually be awake and, and deal with the time you passing. You don't have to look. Oh, time passing. Right. But if you're sedated, it shouldn't bother you. Right, but the time passing is the part that I don't, I'm going to have a problem with. Because Even if you're sedated? Yeah. Right. Conscious awake, talking. Oh, yeah. Hold the gown closed. And they come with the grips on both sides, so it doesn't matter which side you put them on. So they're both left feet. Yes. Because they both have L's. Interesting. I don't think that's what the L is. I think the L is for large. <laughs> okay. Get, get, get more anxious and more anxious about what's going to happen. Yeah. I'm, I'm getting a port put in one side or the other. I'm not sure which side, but it's for, um, connects to the um, vein so that they don't have to puncture a vein every time for chemotherapy. Is it? So they puncture the skin every time, but they don't puncture a vein every time. Oh, so you're actually going to have something embedded in your skin. Yes. And that's why you can shower. And... Yes. So you said you're getting more and more anxious. Is it just today or the whole thing? Well, the whole thing. You know, it's just the surreal thing happening to me. It doesn't really seem real yet, mm -hmm. but every something I do procedure whatever it's just one more step towards reality and it's just really starting to freak me out yeah <laughs> Is this the smaller one? That's that's a little larger. Okay, because this is the one that's an inch and a half then. Yeah. And then this one up here Small one is this. And it's weird because this is still numb. It feels mm -hmm. weird. Yeah. I can't feel anything. It's weird. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> yeah, it was done in radiology where they do the x-rays because mm -hmm. they do x-rays while they're doing it. Um, I didn't get to see anybody except for the nurse because they they had the whole area tented. And once in a while, I'd see some guy pop in, you know, pop in, are you doing okay? <laughs> uh, like I said, I, I, would, I was very, very upset um, because I was scared, you know. Well, you're bound to be. Yeah, so they started, I mean, doing the work and I, I felt a couple of things, it hurt. I felt pressure that hurt, but not like the pricks that I felt. And let me, let, me, let me know if this hurts again, and it did. And he goes, okay, give her some more da-da-da. And we, I saw somebody come around and put some more sedation in my IV or whatever they were giving me. Yeah, right. um, but I was awake the whole time talking to the doctor. Couldn't right. see him, but right. I, 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 once I got the sedation, I was fine. Yeah. I was able yeah. to deal with it. Yeah. So that, that uh, I can attest to, to that now. So being awake while having a procedure oh, done. It, that it's okay. And that it's okay. Yeah. That, especially for me when, when I don't get to see it. Like if they were doing something on my leg, as long as I couldn't see what they were doing, I'd be okay with it being awake because I've gone through that process now. But it's scary. <laughs> it's still scary, oh, yeah. you know. Because it yeah. it's above the incision. Yeah, just above the incision, there's like a little raised bump. Yeah. And that's where the, that's where it is. And then they'll feel that bump for the three the three little bumps on the outside, like a triangle, and yeah. then I know that's where to do the Stick injection. Her. Yeah, stick me. <laughs> yeah. Do you still feel sedated? I, I still feel a little kind of, not loopy, but, but I mean, yeah. But relaxed about the, the situation. Yeah, yeah. I think that's what it did. <laughs> yeah.